Um, there's a difference in, like for instance, I have a love that I have for my, my mother or like the love I have for my best friend, but a romantic kind of love is different. Um, there's a, there's a mm, behind it, like a passion with it, that it's not just like, I care about you deeply, but it's, I care about you deeply and I want to do something about it. And there's a, there's an intention behind it. And so. I mean, I don't know if it has a look. I feel like it's definitely, it's definitely more feeling based. And I think that that's something that's really like, that's definitely perplexing. It's because like, more of when we say I love you, it's because I love in Christ. Um, well, that's how I feel. I don't know if that's really how he feels, but for me, when I say it, it's a love in Christ. I know for me that whoever it is, I'll know because my intentions are my little game time. Yeah. I feel like self-love definitely gets talked about like in, a, in murky waters where like uh, people are like, yeah, I love myself. I'm gonna treat myself, I'm gonna buy myself pizza. Like, you know, like, I'm sure, like, do that for yourself. But I think, like, really, like, understanding yourself and accepting yourself and loving yourself is a whole new platform that I wouldn't have been pushed to be at if it weren't for that relationship turning sour. I think it takes a lot of soul searching, finding out who you are as a person, um, what you like, what you want out of life. Um, I think that's how you get from hate to love, is just finding yourself. Me? Yeah. What do you mean? <laughs>